hi guys good morning today is friday today is easter friday i have a ton of things to do today everybody's at home i did not go for school runs well i didn't go for school runs yesterday either like my kids close kids i think kids everywhere closed on wednesday so i'm excited i'm happy i feel good see uh, all the people in my house i don't understand how their sleep cycle works okay when they are going to school they wake up early no sometimes they actually wake up late when they are going to school actually not late but we have to go and wake them up around seven o'clock when on days that they are going to school on days that they are not going to school everybody will wake up by six o'clock five thirty by everybody i mean this 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 person here this person here what time did you wake up this morning I don't know, but by the time that I was coming out, I saw that it was um six twenty nine. So you have to woke up before, then you stood up by six twenty nine. Why? On a day that you don't, there, there is no school, and it's not just them, including my husband. He'll wake up and he wants to stand up. I told him this thing before. Once he stands up from the bed, if he doesn't even need to stand up, if he's on the bed and he's moving around, I will wake up. Okay, even when he's snoring loudly, I will wake up. Well, I don't, I don't think his snoring actually wakes me up But if I wake up and he's snoring I find it hard to go back to bed Go back to sleep, right? But if he stands up, I will wake up I might sleep back, but I must wake up first So, you're not going to work They're not going to school Why are all of you awake? What is happening? <laughs> the only person that sleeps The way they should sleep in this house is Sophia And then sometimes Ava Not even sometimes, Ava actually sleeps the way she should sleep even when she's not going to school she sleeps in but because of auntie's movements eva wakes up most times so now the time is just mind you we've been awake for a while though the time is just 7 30 and it's almost as if yeah, it's already afternoon because we've already we've already been walking up and down talking too much <laughs> talking too much by the way let me tell you guys something Cora, come 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 let me tell you guys something Cora is now a big girl okay Cora is now a big girl yesterday Cora helps to clean the kitchen the way I clean it. She'll be happy to clean the kitchen since so. But yesterday I told her, see, eh, just clean this kitchen the way mommy will clean it. And I was surprised. Cora removed everything, cleaned everywhere, reset everywhere back to back to square one, like back to the way I normally arrange the kitchen. Cora is also very involved in cooking now. And not like before where she's just helping me bring this, bring that. No. Like yesterday she made eggs while I um, air fry the bacon. She knows how to air fry stuff as well. Then in the evening, while we were, while I was warming beans, she was cutting the plantain for frying. And I was like, eh, my girl is now a good girl. Yeah, so it's really exciting. It's really, I'm really happy and I'm so proud of you. <laughs> I'm really proud of her. I told her yesterday I'm so proud of you. Don't worry, I'll get you something. But you have to keep it up. It's not the one when I finish prison you. Nah. Tomorrow night you not start doing no 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 no. I actually saw a video where a lady was saying that uh, whether she gives her kids like every at the beginning of the year everybody chooses their chores and they do the same chores for the whole year. Okay, so if you choose to clean the rooms, you are going to clean the rooms for the whole year. If you if you choose to clean the kitchen, you are going to do the kitchen for the whole year. Then the next year you have to rotate okay you choose another chore you can't choose the one you had the previous year you choose another chore i think i'm going to implement that okay i think i'm going to do that because initially i was like ah no they need to learn how to be all around that no not really like as long as they know how to do other things they know how to do it but they're not just doing it that's a different case right and for me doing one chores well, one chores <laughs> for me doing one chore throughout the year or even if it's six months but i think she said throughout the year doing one chore will make you master that chore like master it very well then you move on to master a different chore right and yeah as long as it's just one year it's not like the person will never enter the kitchen it's not like the person will never help in the kitchen it's just that for this one year it's another person's designated chore then the next year it might be your own designated chore so i think i'm going to implement that anyway you guys know that i like scarves a lot right i like scarves i like um turbans like different head pieces i actually like them i got this um set of scarves there are actually three scarves here i got them from a brand called day my lane okay that's d-a-y my lane they are on instagram they sent it to me a while ago Funny enough, when I received these scarves, right, 
I was like, oh, I'm going to unbox it on camera and all of that. I now kept it somewhere safe. Okay. <laughs> I kept it somewhere safe. After keeping it that somewhere safe, I did not find it again. I was just like, which guy will I be this? And I just left it out on about to maybe I would have seen it. But I kept it somewhere safe and I, I did not um, see it again. But the day I found it and I brought it out, that's why I remembered it. Anyway, so these are scarves and you guys this scarf is so big i love it this is something you can tie oh, oh shift mm -hmm. guys, you guys know see me now i'm actually what's my height i think i'm 5'9 or 5'10 not sure see how big this is my wrapper yeah it is very very big which i absolutely appreciate and and see what is written on it. This one says, wait, uh -huh. this one says, Nne idi okay. <laughs> Can you guys see this? It says, Nne idi okay, okay, yes, Adam okay, I'm mom nam di okay, okay. But yeah, that's what the scarf says. I love the colors, I love these colors so much and yeah very beautiful one thing i like about this scarf and especially the size of it is that you can style it anyhow let me see the second one i haven't opened these ones yet i just left them the way they were look at the packaging they came in very nice very sleek and very nice packaging look at it so this is just plain orange and pop is this orange and purple or orange and blue very nice the, the size of this one is actually smaller than the first one i showed you guys but this one is still bigger than the regular small scarves this one i can still tie it you guys i'm about to be tying this every day <laughs> if you know me you know me I'm about to be tying this scarf every day. I hate when I have to go for school runs, especially in the mornings, and I will start looking for wig to wear. I mean, I have some very easy shake and wear wigs that I wear for it, right? But if I don't have to wear wigs, I don't want to wear wigs. Let me see this last one. Again, the same very nice packaging. Oh, this one is so cute. Let me leave it half like, halfway like this so you guys can see it. Can you guys see this pattern? Nkem means mine, okay? Obim means my heart. Then Umanang means honey, okay? So it is there, it is at the back as well. A bigger a bigger um, write-up. Nice, nice, nice. This will make such a nice gift from a partner, from like maybe your boyfriend or your husband or your whatever fiance. This will make such a nice gift. So if you know any guy that is looking for gifts to buy for his girlfriend, send him the link, okay, or buy for his wife, send him the link. It works, like who doesn't like scarves, who doesn't use scarves, you can tie this, this is actually big as well. I think this one, I'll check, I'm not sure, but I think this one is slightly bigger than the one on my head and the first one, so this, this is big bigger biggest okay you guys you can check them out i'm going to leave their link in the description box or their name on the screen just go to instagram and type day my lane you will see their page and place your order okay anyway i'm going to leave some on my head though i'm removing it again i'm not removing it again <laughs> uh, but i think i need to wash it too so i need to finally mount these pictures i have just kept them at this corner for a very long time i'm going to mount them today somewhere around here i also want to mount this somewhere in my office i need something like in my second on my second channel i need something on the wall because i feel like my setup is always like me and this background on one side then a blank wall on the other side so i just took this thing from my from cora's room i'm going to mount it here because cora's room i haven't finished arranging it well so instead of this thing to just be there looking let me mount it here um, I'll use command hooks to put it here then I'll also maybe make another painting or frame or something to put beside it just have something on the wall here so that the wall is not just that blank I'm also going to be having a live video today on my second channel by Nigerian 8 p.m. okay 7 p.m. UK time 
8 p.m. in Nigeria. So on my second channel, the kind of live stream I do is we bring a topic and we discuss the topic. Okay, it's not like it's not just regular live stream where you're just asking questions and I'm just answering. No, like we have a particular topic and we discuss it. And the last one we had on Wednesday, we discussed all about um Pastor Funke's advice to newlyweds, not newlyweds, to people going to see their in-laws, whatever, or prospective or prospective in-laws, how they should act. So we discussed all about it in the last live and it went well i mean for the first live on that other channel it actually went well even though i figured out that i made some mistakes afterwards the layout of the live is not what was showing on my screen <laughs> it's almost like i didn't know that my screen was mirroring how the live was supposed to, how the live was showing to you guys so the placement of the video was a different place um so i'm going to i'm going to fix that today then also what else again did i discover that i should have done in the last video I think that was that was it. I think that was it. The layout was not um, done properly, but every other thing worked well. So yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing you guys there today. Today we're going to be discussing that viral video where one woman said, even if uh, her husband molests her child or whatever, that yes, she'll report him, on, but it doesn't mean that she's going to divorce her husband. Get that into your head. I don't she even put it. I want you to understand that wow anyway so we're going to be discussing all about that in today's live so please just head over to the channel i'm sure after i post this video it will be it will be maybe like one or two hours before the live so please head over there and join the live okay thank you eva has not even said hi to me this morning she just woke up went downstairs aspa aspa big girl that she is eva yeah all right please take this thing downstairs Put it in the laundry. Okay, put it in the laundry so I'll wash it. And bye bye. Eva, yeah. I know you like cartons and stuff. What do you want? Mm -hmm. Take one, take one. Thank see, you. <laughs> see how excited she is. Go and wash your mouth. Eva likes all these packages, carton, anything. She likes all those kind of things. She likes it so much because she's always crafting with them. That reminds me, tomorrow, Cora has a birthday party to attend. A friend of hers invited her for, it's not a birthday party, it's like a, her friend invited her and one other friend for a day out, basically. So the girl's mom now told me that, um, you know, she wants us to meet at, um, what did she call that place? I forgot the name of the place, but it's like a, it's an indoor, um, events place where they do like trampoline, um, bon not bungee jumping, trampoline climbing, all those things. Yeah, anyway, a place like that. So that's where we are going tomorrow. But I have bought the girl's birthday gift, so I need to. You guys, I want to understand, even though by the time you guys see this video, okay, it's not too late, but by the time you guys see this video, but I want to understand the etiquette surrounding birthday invites, okay? I bought a birthday gift for the girl and a card, I mean, from Cora. But I want to know if that is a thing here. I hope I'm not doing too much or I'm not doing too little. Am I supposed to buy maybe like wine for the mom or something? Let me let me know in the comment section. There's still time so that tomorrow I can adjust my ways. <laughs> but I bought a gift for the girl. So I need to package that gift today. Cora is going to write in her card today as well. Um, but yeah, just let me know. Even though they are inviting us out, I'm still going to carry money over because I, I've heard before that here, even if they invite you for birthday party, you can they might ask you to buy your own food <laughs> pay for your own food <laughs> wahala uh so because i've heard about that i'll still go with money even though when i was even that i'll still go with money because i need to i'll be going with eva and sophia as well even though they invited only cora so when cora is with her friend doing the birthday whatever i'll just having fun together i'll take eva and sophia to go and have their own fun i'll pay for them and everything to go and have their own fun there as well because from the pictures the place looks really nice so i'm sure eva and sophia are going to be very very happy the, mo the mom was telling me that if i don't want to stay like if i have other things to do i can leave cora with them and then she will drop cora off um drop cora at home like afterwards but i was like what's the what am i able to do not have to do plus i don't want her siblings to just be left behind so that is why i need to i need to carry them along so i have to carry money for i mean i always carry money though but i have to just put it in mind that if they don't offer me anything <laughs> let me not be offended because that's how they said some people i don't know if i don't think it's all people sure. some people do birthday parties here but so far so good i like the girl i like her mom do you know that sometimes uh, you can actually 
like parents because of or be friends with parents because of their kids because the girl is such a very lovely girl she just reminds me of Cora she's like Cora's twin somehow in terms of the way they behave in terms of the way they interact and kind of things they like you know the kind of people that <laughs> when I say Cora has found her tribe that girl and some of Cora's friends are the people I'm referring to because it's like Cora on steroids, in fact, Cora in different bodies, that's how the girls are All these very emotional girls are always like, oh Cora When they come to school, when I drop them, when I drop Cora at school and Cora sees her friends They will not go, oh, they will hug each other, as if no, they did not see the day before I'm like, what is happening here? So Cora has actually found her tribe and I'm very very excited for her for that So because of the girl, I now like her mom Her mom is, you can tell that it's from the mom though Her mom is a very lovely person as well, so yeah, anyway all this talk is just because I'm not in the mood to go downstairs. <laughs> but let me go, I have things to do. You guys, see all the clothes we have to wash today. <laughs> anyway, this one is daddy that will do this one, Sha, but it's a lot. A lot, a lot. So I went to bring this thing from the store. I went to bring these crates from the store. I'm going to clean them up now and use them to arrange under the staircase because I want to just put like a. Oh, you guys will see what I want to do with it. Toy like toy basket, but it will almost be like a table, not. Do you get? Oh, I'd really like if we were allowed to like paint it or something. No, I don't want to paint it though. Should I? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but well, I'll have to buy paint now. What well, time for that one? <laughs> you guys, me that I like um, DIY since I came to the UK, I've not had the mental bandwidth to even engaging a just a thoughtless diy <laughs> i don't have that energy okay uh, yeah i tried i also made yogurt the other day that was yesterday two days ago i made yogurt because since i got to this place whenever i want to buy greek yogurt they have so many options and you'll be seeing zero percent two percent this one percent i'm like what is all this i don't know I feel like they don't just have like regular regular Greek yogurts. Let me know if you are in the UK, if you know like regular plain Greek yogurts that just has all the full all the all the full fats. Like I want full fats regular Greek yogurts. I don't want low fat, I don't want zero percent, I don't want all those things. I want full fat normal Greek yogurts. If you are in the UK, just tell me the brand that you know, that has it. I always buy the Asa brand itself. But they call it Greek style yogurts, not Greek yogurts, okay? It's not even that thick. So I just made my own the other day, but I do not have that cloth for sieving out the water from the yogurt. Sieving out the water is what makes it Greek yogurt essentially. I didn't have that cloth, but I made yogurt myself and it was very simple actually, very, very simple. So I'm going to be making more, but I need to buy that cloth first because I, I really want a very, very thick yogurt. I don't understand what is going on with this song. This song is just dancing around. <laughs> yeah, okay, Cora is clearing there so that we can stay there and wrap her friend's gift and other things. Let me show you guys the gift I bought. So I got this doll. I got it from Amazon because I bought it for Eva, I bought it for Cora, and they really, really loved it. So I bought it for the friend. It is the type that you can you can basically change the outfits, decorate the outfits, even change the face. So many things. It's a very nice gift for an eight-year-old. Very nice gift for an eight-year-old. I'll leave a link to it in the description box in case you want to check it out. But a very nice gift. I bought this twenty-three pounds. Yeah, so it's nice. You guys, I was even telling Cora that I want Eva to come and help her. She was like, "No, I can do it by myself. You just need to come and help me." See, eh? Is it the age? I think it's the age, Joe. No. It's not the age. So what is it? I just wanted to do it myself. Yeah, I know. I mean, why do you want to do it yourself? It's because you are now older no. and what? Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. I'm <laughs> doing my psychologist work here. Because, um, okay, we need to clear this thing. So just like, well, them are still wet. It's no longer I watch them. You guys, I got these crates from a brand called Baskets and Crates in Nigeria, okay? So I bought it when I was in Nigeria. It was one of the things I put inside the container coming here. Like I didn't order it from here. Or it was when I was in Nigeria and I was setting up my pantry. I bought it from them. So we used it there. 
but you know shortly after we, <laughs> we relocated so i now packed it and i like it it's very sturdy very good very nice i just cleaned this through now i gave her my specifications i also made baskets with her the baskets that i showed you guys in my house store the one that is inside the storage under the, near the staircase right so yeah so she, i gave her my dimensions and she made them to my specifications okay so if you want them and they're quality wood though quality pine pine wood very nice very sturdy very good um so if you want them you can go and check them out hey, don't follow. Mm -hmm. I you guys i want to make moi moi this afternoon just a little moi moi but I forgot to bring out the fish from the freezer yesterday. So now I am I'm forced first defrosting fish, which is very annoying. I'm forcing it to defrost first. Okay, so uh, while the fish is defrosting or whatever melting, I'm going to take this crate. Sophia, come, let's go. Let's take the crates to Can you carry it? No, 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 no. Eh? It doesn't fall on your head, eh? It <laughs> Just push it. Okay, I want to carry. Careful, just keep it there. Come inside here, eh? Inside this bin. Put all your toys inside the bin. Carry all the toys. Fast, fast, fast. Everybody join hands. Put on, move all these toys. Oh yeah.
Nej, mor i What's happening here? Everybody's just tap, 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 tap. Hmm? Hmm? Daddy gave you people. Eh? Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. All right, to you can enjoy. So I have moi moi on the stove cooking now. I should have made more of that moi moi. I feel like I didn't make enough. But I didn't want to make too much because I don't want to store it for too long And that's the last bean flour that I have Not beans but beans flour And I don't want to blend the other beans that I have Who even wants to go to that stress of washing beans and blending it So that's the last beans flour that I have So I was trying to just save some for Akara another day But yeah, um, the time now is past 12 And I am officially done for the day I feel like I need to go and sleep <laughs> I think I've done a lot this morning, you guys, you won't even believe it um, My kids are just chilling, my husband is chilling as well But me, I have to edit this video, then I have to start getting ready for my live um, It's 7pm anyway, but I like to set up everything, make sure everything is working well Before I can now go and do other things I've not even had breakfast too But yeah, that's how our first public holiday in the UK is going <laughs> That's how it's going. That's how the day is going actually. Like the day is just going. We've not done anything. Before I had plans to take my kids out. We we're supposed to go for a walk. Me and my husband as well. We we're supposed to go for a walk at some point. We were also supposed to read with the kids. That is read scriptures, read Bible, and just talk about the whole Easter stuff and what the significance of you know this Friday is. So we're still going to do that anyway, but that will end up being in the night because right now. I'm tired. <laughs> anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I'll see you all in my next video. I'm smelling of fish. I feel like I can smell fish on my body. Not really, but I can smell fish. Is it my hand? I don't know. Anyway, I'm still gonna have my bath. Bye.